So, today I got for you guys, or whoever's watching, my Bakura, my Yami Bakura Destiny Board deck. So let's take a look at the skill. So the skill Destiny Board can be used if Dark Necrofear, which is this card here, we'll get into her in a bit, is in your graveyard and your life points are at 2000 or below. So this card needs to be in my graveyard as long as my life points at 2000 or below. At the end of your fifth turn, after activating the skill, you win the duel. So after five turns, you, it's an instant win. This skill is negated if Dark Necrofear, which is her, leaves your graveyard. The skill can only be used once per duel. So you need her to be in your graveyard and you need 2,000 life points to win. And when it says um, after five turns, because it's spelling out the word um, final. So final takes five, it's five words. So it takes five turns to um, spell. So I'm running three dark necrofear. Cannot be normal summoned or set. Must be first, must first be special summoned from your hand by banishing three fiend type monsters from your graveyard during the end phase. If this card is in the graveyard because it was destroyed by an opponent's card this turn by battle or card effect and sent to your graveyard while it was a monster card under your control, target one phase up monster your opponent controls, equip this card to that target. While this card is equipped to a monster by this effect, take control of that monster. Now we don't regularly use her effect, we just need her in our graveyard so that's why we're running her at 3. Next up is Sphere Karibo. Basically, if he, he um, Karibo's in Sphere Karibo's in your hand when your mon when your opponent um, declares an attack, you can negate that attack and um, switch their attacking monster into defense position. This card is they're just little tech choice. I don't know how to say any of that except maidens, so let's call them maidens. <laughs> So this is a flip card. So you want to summon this card face down in defense mode and her defense points is 2000. So it's kind of like a wall for your opponent to get through if they don't have anything over 2000. So when this card, so when face down cards are attacked, they're flipped over. So it's flip effect is flip. You can draw one card, then discard one card. And then it's other effect is once per turn, you can change this card to face down defense position. So we're just using this to cycle through our deck to try and get um, Necrofear into our graveyard because we need that. All right, and probably the best card <laughs> in this damn deck if, you know, they don't have any removal cards. Fortress Warrior. You take no battle damage from attacks involving this card. Once per turn, this card cannot be destroyed by battle. So it can sponge up an attack and if, and if they don't have any, uh, so it's going to take two monsters to kill this low attack and defense card because of its effect of once per turn, this card cannot be destroyed by battle. So we only can have three monsters on the field. So that's going to take up two attacks for this one monster. And we're definitely running him at three. This card I got so lucky getting, uh, I need one more. I'll be so blessed if I get one, at least one more of Kiteroid. During damage calculation, if your opponent's monster attacks directly, you can discard this card. You take no battle damage from that battle. During damage calculation, if your opponent's monster attacks directly, you can banish this card from your graveyard and you take no damage from that battle. So he, this one card is blocking twice. <laughs> it's like Fortress. And the second time is if he's in the graveyard. So that's pretty good. Then we have regular Karibo. During your opponent's turn at damage calculation, you can just discard this card. You take no battle damage from that battle. Bacon Saber. <laughs> During either player's battle step, while an attack is occurring, you can banish this card from your graveyard and negate the attack. So I run him at two. 
regiki break i'm definitely gonna take out if i were to well i don't know because it has the discard one card i i want more cards like that so i can cycle through my deck and then you know hopefully get um necro fear and the damn graveyard quicker but anyways regiki break discard one card then target one card on the field destroy it counter gate when an opponent's monster declares a direct attack negate the attack and if you do draw one card then if it is a monster immediately after this effect resolves you can normal summon it in place of attack position so this is really good especially if it's comboed with like fortress warrior or um just i think for fortress warrior is the best bet um rainbow life <laughs> Discard one card. Until the end of this turn, whenever you would take damage, you gain that amount of life points instead. I thought one time, I thought this was just for one attack. And then my opponent swung with another monster because I thought, because he, he was probably thinking it was for one attack too. I gained like 6,000 life points. <laughs> oh my God, it was so funny. I guess it's for the whole damage turn. But yeah, so again, discard one card. Okay. This card I'm definitely taking out, Draining Shield. When an opponent's monster declares an attack, target the attacking monster. Negate that attack. And if you do, gain life points equal to that target's attack. So say someone swings at me for 3,000, I target that monster, and then instead of getting the attack, I gain the attack of that monster in life points. The reason why I want to get rid of this is one, I don't use it, and it's only a one of, and two, it targets and targeting is never good in Yu-Gi-Oh! Whereas Rainbow Life, it doesn't target. It just happens when it happens. So yeah. I definitely want another Wall of Disruption, Wall of D. When an opponent's monster declares an attack, all attack position monsters your opponent controls loses 800 attack for each monster they control. That's really good, bitch. Alright, and then the last two cards, I ran two of Burst Rebirth. Pay 2,000 life points. Then target one monster in your graveyard. Special summon that target in face down defense position. Um, pay 2,000. So there goes my one of my requirements to activate my skill. And then I get to bring a monster from my graveyard. And uh, you know who I'm bringing back if he's in there. All right, so let's get started with this video. Um, there's this really sexy play that I do. And I'm like... <laughs> I can't believe I pulled it off, but I slayed the bitch. <sighs> Thanks for watching, and if you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get into it. Go! How interesting. You'll regret challenging me to a duel. <laughs> it's my turn. I end my, my turn. turn. I draw. From my hand, I activate a spell. Show yourself. Fusion Summon. From my hand, I activate a spell. how much stronger I am than you. I'll blow you away. I activate my monster's effect. I end my turn. <laughs> Make your mind to draw. Set a monster. You won't escape from me. 
I flip over my set card. Come on out. And here I, I go. Ten. My turn. I draw. From my hand, I activate an equip spell. You'll see how much stronger I am than you. I'll blow you away. My monster attack. I'll blow you away. Attack! Not so far! My monster effect activates! I end my turn. Here I go! Draw! I draw. Let's battle. I'll blow you away. My monster Not attack. Not so far. I activate my face to her car. My trap activates. I end my turn. <laughs> it's my turn. Draw. My and turn. My turn. I draw. Join me. You'll see how much stronger I am than you. Blue eyes, white dragon. Ah! White! I end my turn. <laughs> it's my draw! I my turn. My turn. I draw. What? This cannot be! Join me! I summon a monster! Let's battle! Get him! I attack! I end my turn. It's my turn. Draw! Set a monster! I Here I go. My turn. My turn. I draw. Let's battle. I'll blow you away. Attack! Blue eyes, white dragon, attack! I end my Here turn. I go. My draw! Set a monster! Here I go. My turn. My turn. I draw. I set a card. Let's battle. Get him. I attack him. Huh. Not so fast. My monster effect activates. White dragon, attack! I end my <laughs> turn. Make my your move. Draw. I set a card face down. I set a monster. Face Here I go. My turn. My turn. I draw. Join me. Tribute summon. I 
I activate my monster's effect. You'll see how much stronger I am than you. Take this. I attack! Blue Eyes, White Dragon, attack! White Lightning! I end my turn. Here I go! Draw! Set a cut face down! Here I go. Ten. My turn. I draw. I set a card. You'll see how much stronger I am than you. I'll blow you away. My monster attacks. Blue eyes, white dragon, attack. White lightning. I end my turn. Here I go. Draw! Okay, so right here is where I not panic, but I'm like, okay, I don't have a Necrofear in the damn graveyard. And I only have a couple cards left, and I'm going to lose by deck out. Because the first player that runs out of cards loses even though i'm winning in life points i only have six cards and i'm like what the fuck and i need five turns to win <laughs> i was definitely like what is going on but i think on this turn is when everything turned around for me so he makes a direct attack and i was depending on if i should negate it with the biggest saber or this card right here, Countergate. I was like, let me try Countergate because it's going to cycle my deck. It's going to give me a card and then I can play it. And this was probably the best decision because now I have a three and five chance of getting Necrofear since I have three of her in my deck. And the other two cards are random, the other two random cards. So that Fortress that I got off of the trap helped me out because I didn't have to draw it next turn. Okay, and I got Necrofear. So what I do here is I use... Um, what did I do? Oh, I used Burst Rebirth to expend my life points down to 2,000. Then I activated Destiny Board. Because, oh, because I got Necrofear in the graveyard off of Rainbow Life because I had to discard a card. So then I did, oh, that was beautiful and sexy. So now I have Necrofear and I activated Destiny Board. So there goes the F. I need four more turns. And yeah. So yeah, that was the sexy play. I activated Rainbow Life, discarded one card, which was Dark Necrofear. Then used Burst Rebirth to spend 2,000 life points in order to bring back Fortress and then to trigger my Destiny board. Ooh! Tell me that was a deck. My monster effect activates! I end my turn. Uh, now, my turn! Let's uh, see what you can do. Draw. My turn's done! <laughs> it's my turn. I draw. I activate my monster's effect! My monster attacks! I'll 
I'll blow you away. My monster attacks! I end my turn. Now, my let's turn. see what you can do. I draw! Set a coward face down! It's my turn. I draw. You'll see how much stronger I am. There's nowhere left to run. Nothing. Get out of my sight. I attack you directly. Not so fast. Yes, I face that come. My trap activates. My monster's effect. You will wander the darkness until the end of time. Hold on. There's my face down card. My trap activates. Come on <laughs> out. I summon a monster to anything. You'll see how much stronger I am than you. I'll blow you away. My monster, there's nowhere left to run. Hold on. Blue eyes, white dragon, monster, monster. white lightning. I end my turn. <laughs> it's my turn. Draw. <laughs> Too stunned to do anything. Demise! Dark Necrophil! Pathetic mortal! 